That's what happens when you do more than one hot dog eating contest in a row. You throw up green bile. That is disgusting. Hey guys, it's the Plum Dot here, and welcome back to my channel for part number three of Wright Designs. So we left the lovely Frankie Ruth Wright, having just finished a gym renovation for paramedic Gavin, and she did a pretty good job. So I sent her home because she was very hungry, and I had every intention of getting her up on Thursday morning and having her go out and either do a book nook or a writing room because I know that is exactly what you guys wanted to see. However, it is actually actually leisure day so Frankie doesn't have work today but I thought I would have her do some architectural research so we're gonna have her take that sketch and while she was doing said research she actually got a promotion um, so we will have her do that so Frankie got a promotion and it says congratulations Frankie has been conferred the new title of placement planner by the Appaloosa Plains Town Council in recognition of her valuable con contributions to the workforce. Your career is off to a decent start with a few good projects behind you. It's time to get together a portfolio to showcase pictures of your work. Maybe you could use it to convince neighborhood sims that they need your expertise for their next remodel. Frankie Wright can use a portfolio to show other sims her work. Maybe one of them will have a project ready for her to do. Frankie now makes 400 per week and works 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. So since we are now level three, I believe we can actually go out in town and drum up business. So even though it's leisure day, I think I can send Frankie out and she can speak to the town folk and see what she can do for them. So I do believe that is what we are going to do. And since she's got the wish to go to the summer festival, I'm gonna send her over here and let her visit the summer festival so that she can see what the town folk need from her and assess their design needs. So I will pick up with you guys as soon as Frankie gets over to the festival. So we're gonna have a little look-see and see who was bopping around town and it looks like we've got Sims arriving. So we've got Patricia Bedlington here and then we've got Honey Darnell. Let's swing around and take a look at old Honey Darnell. Oh my! What big eyes you have, honey, and big lips, hmm? I think we're gonna have Frankie come over and do a friendly introduction to Honey Darnell as she walks closer to our screen. That was kind of creepy. Um, but we will have these two meet each other. If I can see where Frankie has gone, where have you gone, my love? Straight into the toilets, why not? But she's gonna go and she's going to meet Honey Darnell. If Honey Darnell will stop for us, that would be good. Oh, what was that? What was that action? Oh, look at that. I don't care what anyone else thinks. I think you are hot. Well, this could go very, very well. So we are going to be a little bit friendly. We're going to chat with Honey Darnell, and we are going to get to know her. And let's see if we're going to announce her promotion and let her know, you know, that we are here to be the home design hotshot of Appaloosa Plains and see what she says about that. And then we will assess her needs. And that is a big horsey. This is Marnie Martingale. And I don't know why Marnie Martingale is in the toilets. Can you, can you jog on horse? You're in the way. Oh, the puppy. Look at the puppy. Ditz Riffin. That's so cute. Where's she going? rude who's this this is calvin riffin okay so if honey doesn't want to talk maybe we will talk to calvin so we're going to french fren frenchly friendly introduce ourselves to calvin who's that that's quincy miller let's see if calvin's up for a bit of renovation oh look at that she is on fire <gasps> frankie's on fire I love this. Okay, so she's going to chat. Um, friendly. Uh, get to know. Let's see if we can find out any of his traits. Friendly. Announce promotion. Now that I think about it, we are in the toilets, so I'm sure these Sims didn't just come in here to hang out. They'll probably all need to go to the bathroom, including the horses that keep coming in here. Hello, Bramble Fox. Oh, I think that's Shawnee Fox's horse. 
That is a big old horse. Could you imagine if that thing kicked Frankie in the ass? She would go flying. Oh, so he's into cameras. That's cool. Maybe they have some things in common. She wants to, what does this say? Reach level five, go roller skating, take a greeting card picture. Right, maybe we'll have her take a greeting card picture while she was sh while, while she's here at the festival. Who is making that ra racket, that awful racket? I like how she's accosting people in the bathroom. Um, did we announce our promotion? Okay, and then as soon as we're finished announcing our promotion, we are going to assess his architectural design needs and see if we can help Calvin out. He's happy for us, so maybe he trusts us. If, if Frankie's getting promotions, she must be a darn good architectural designer, and he is here for it. That went well. Calvin is more likely to accept a job proposal from you now if you offer your services. Well, let's see what Calvin needs. We're here to help. Offer to remodel home. I will give you the Mona Lisa. How do you like that picture of the gym, old Calvin? Hmm? Let's just shimmy on down here. Take a look at that. Frankie's all proud of her gym renovation. Ooh, he's got to like that. What? That's rude. Well, you're not getting a date, Calvin. Unfortunately, Calvin Riffin won't be needing Frankie's services at, at this time. Was it the half-naked girl that he didn't like? Hmm? Okay, where did Honey go? Let's finish our conversation with Honey. Let's zoom on out here and see if we can spot Honey with the big eyes. <laughs> Where'd she go? She Oh, she's doing the pie eating contest. Um, so I guess while she's doing that, because Frankie wants to take a greeting card photo, uh, let's have her take a greeting card photo with Calvin Riffin. Let's make his day. Let's Let's give Calvin a little thrill. He's ready for it. We're gonna go get in the photo booth. Is this a woohoo spot? Can you woohoo with people in the photo booth? Perfect. Are they finished? I think they're finished. So we are gonna go back and we're gonna announce a promotion because Honey needs to hear about it even though she's stuffing her face with hot dogs. You lost, Honey, it's over. Get over it, you lost. Ooh, and she's got enough lifetime happiness points. Perfect. Um, well then, I believe the first one that I want to get is Observant Purchase. Thank you. Hey, honey, I just got a promotion. She's all smiles and everything. She's all here for it. She's happy for us. Thumbs up. Oh, she is a great kisser. Should we find out? No, we're not going to go in there for the kill. I'm going in for the kill. Right, let's see if we can get to know Honey a little bit better. She's a virtuoso. She's flirty. Ooh, virtuoso. I wonder if she likes... She's got to like music. I wonder if she needs a music room. That would be fun. Um, let's assess her design needs after we get to know her a little bit better. And hope that we don't get kicked in the face by Marnie. Because that would ruin our day. Look at all these horses just running around rampant. Do you guys have barns to live in or something? She's also charismatic. Can you see it? Do you see my vision for your house, honey? Oh, yes. Honey is like, okay. Okay. You can come and renovate my home. So let's uh, show her our design portfolio. Let's offer to remodel honey's home and see if she is ready for it. Those eyes. She's got very starey eyes. Look at them. Dairy eyes and no eyebrows. Yes, yes, uh huh, uh huh. How do you feel? Yes, success! Ooh, she wants to study. I like to impress my friends by bragging about how smart I am. I'm not entirely sure they believe me, so I'd like you to build me a study. Then when they come over, 
they will see a knowledge infused infused room and believe me honey darnell i think we can help you so she wants a, a blah, blah, blah. she wants a sofa bookshelves a coffee table a tv and a desk i do believe we may be able to help you out honey that is so very loud um so let's get out of tab mode and let's should we visit the lot should we do it oh crap i should have got inappropriate but in a good but in a good way that's the first thing that i wanted so that she didn't kick out get kicked out when she needed to pee so we're gonna have her go to the bathroom oh somebody clogged that up somebody did a big old dookie in there gross okay so we're gonna have to use that and even if we don't get to it today, it'll probably still be on the map. So Honey's Place may be the first place that we visit tomorrow if we don't get to it before, you know, Frankie enjoys a little bit more of the festival. Um, so she's going to go to the bathroom and then, does she have tickets to redeem? Nope, she's got no tickets to redeem. Um, who's this? Oh, she's a pop, pop, paparazzi. Okay, so... Let's um, be friendly. Let's chat to her again. Um, let's tell her a funny story. And then I think maybe we'll just have Frankie enjoy the rest of the festival and get an early start tomorrow because she is quite tired. She is a little bit hungry. But hey, at least we drummed up business. People were happy about our promotion. They are happy that we are here to make over their houses. So once she is finishing, finished having a little conversation with uh, old Honey Darnell. And who's this man? Quincy Miller. Quincy Miller wants to get in on the action. Maybe we'll have Frankie meet Quincy and then have her pick some flowers and then probably go home so that she can get an early start tomorrow. The more people she meets, the more business she can drum up. I am ready for this. What is this? Garlic. Do we want garlic? We don't want garlic. We don't need garlic. Okay, so she's going to just chat over there and then I'm going to have her come over here and... Oh, he's a green thumb. Maybe we should assess his needs, too. When in Rome, my friends, when in Rome. Um, so let's chat, and let's get to know, and then let's assess his needs. All in a day's work, so he's good. He's green thumb, family-oriented, and that will be there waiting for us tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Honey, we'll see you tomorrow. Ooh, Honey loves her food. That is the second time she's gone for the hot dog eating contest. Okay, so let's see how this goes. He's ready for it, too. It's like everybody just need, wants their house renovated. So let's offer to remodel his home and see what he needs done. Check out those pictures. Huh, Quincy? You like that? You like my profile? Or my portfolio? Profile? This isn't a dating site. Look at that. Handshake. Okay, so he wants a new bedroom set. I've been having a hard time sleeping. I seriously hate my bed and pretty much everything in my bedroom. Do you think you could hook me up with a new bed? A new bed set? Stereo, dresser, single bed, fireplace, and a rug. Why would you want a single bed, Quincy? That's weird. So we will accept that, but we're not going to begin that today. I'm so sorry. That is so loud. Um, so we are going to finish off Frankie's pretty darn good day at the summer festival with picking some flowers because we could use the money. We are only making 400 simoleons per week, and I know those cosmos are worth a pretty penny, so we're not going to leave those here for somebody else to pick. Um, so she's going to pick all the flowers. All the flowers, they would sit and talk to me for hours. In a world of my own. Did we get them all? Did we get them all? I think we got them all. 
perfecto. So what I am going to do, because the summer festival has ended for the day, is I am actually going to send, what is this? Make a snow cone. Can you make a snow cone? Is there a snow cone machine here? Why would you want to make a snow cone if there's no snow cone machine here? I don't see a snow cone machine here. You can't make a snow cone. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to send Frankie home for the night and get her all fed, all rested, so that she can either take on Quincy's renovation or Honey's renovation and then see what else is on the map for us to do. I feel like we're going to have lots of options and we like options. So let's send the girl home. Oh wait, no, we forgot a flower. Can't forget the black eyed Susan. And yep, yeah, I'm gonna send her home and I will pick, oh look. <laughs> That's what happens when you do more than one hot dog eating contest in a row. You throw up green bile. That is disgusting. Yeah, so I'm gonna send Frankie home. And I will pick up with you guys in the morning on Friday for a fresh new day. All right, it's Friday morning. Frankie is just getting up, getting ready to start her day. She had quite a late night. I don't think she jumped into bed until about 1 a.m. So hopefully she won't be too tired to complete some renovations for us today, or at least one renovation. And we are going to check out the map very shortly, but let's have her eat some leftovers of some pancakes, pancakes to start the day. And then hopefully by the time she's finished showering, finished eating she will be ready to go and paint the town sienna <laughs> if that's what you want to call it um yes so let's jump into map view let's have a little look-see so this is an exterior makeover i'm still not ready to take those on We've got lots of stuff to do um here's the study Here's a man cave, that could be fun. There's the new bedroom set, and there's a single lady's den. Um, so let's have her do that while we check out um, where this man cave is. It's for, oh, it's for Mr. Riffin, who said that he didn't want our design services. Huh, and then he show up on the map, Mr. Riffin. That could be fun to do a little man cave in. And then we've got the bedroom set here and this is for I believe this is for Quincy Miller am I making that up I could be making that up that is a super cute house I think we're gonna come over here and do the new bedroom set because then we've got the man cave that's next door and I know we've still got the exterior makeover and also the study to do and as well as a single ladies den but I think we're gonna come over here and visit the Miller household and see what we can do with them with their single bed and a fireplace in a room. That's just a weird combination. So I will pick up with you guys when Frankie gets to the Miller household. Frankie has arrived and hopefully somebody is here, but look at how cute this house is. I love this. It's like a seventies house. So cute. Is anybody home? Knock, knock. Knock. Oh, I see a kitty in there. No, get off your phone. Uh, visit the Miller household. Is nobody there? Hello. Hello. Anybody for anybody? Okay, I don't think anybody's here. Ding dong. So we might just have to begin the renovation and check out where we're going to put this single bedroom with a fireplace. Okay, so... I would say that this is the place to do it, and my god, look at the pink flooring. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to add another bedroom. I think I'll just renovate this one and give it a new sort of freshening up and um, get rid of this atrocious... No wonder he wants a new bedroom set, the poor dear. Yeah, this is going to be the place. We are going to help out old Quincy Miller rip up this carpet and repurpose some of this furniture. So let's go.
Okay, that took me quite some time, but I think I am ready to turn in the renovation. So hopefully Quincy Miller likes it. And I forgot to say that the budget was 7,000 simoleons and we've got about 1,087 left and the fee on completion is 200 simoleons. So hopefully we get a pretty darn good review. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to turn it in and hopefully he likes it. So here we go. So Quincy is on his way. Great to hear it's finished. I'll come over to see as soon as I can. Please wait for me here. I hope that doesn't mean like we have to... Ooh, puppy! <gasps> Hi, puppy. Where are you going? No, I don't think so. Um, You're not going home. Where is she going? Are you going to him to tell him it's complete? I sure as hell hope she's not going home. Oh my god, that's the weirdest thing in the world. So she's just traveled in a taxi to come to... Where are we? Where is she? To come to City Hall to tell him that the renovation is complete. So then do we have to go back to his house? What the heck is going on? Watch client evaluate renovation. Okay, better get back in a taxi then and go see him finish the renovation. Hey, Quincy, can I get a ride or something? What the heck? What is she doing? You're not going to walk there. Hail a taxi or something. Awesome. Let's just stand in the middle of the road. Oh my god, what the heck? Right, where's Quincy's house? Is it this one over here? Oh, for God's sake, where was I? I think it was over here. Uh, tell client the renovation is complete. What the heck? Okay, so now she's in a taxi. Here we go. And I swear to God, I just saw Quincy go by on a bike. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so funny. So we finally got Quincy Miller home, so she's going to tell him that the renovation is complete. Hopefully he likes it. Um, so he's going to go and re-evaluate or evaluate the room. And let's let's see if there's head nods. Ooh, we got a smile there. We're here for the smiles. We're here for the smiles. We got some finger kisses. Oh. Oh. How's he feel about that painting, the wheelhouse painting? Yep, we got a nod. We've got a nod. Oh, maybe this will be our first great job. First great job. How do you feel about your new desk that you didn't ask for, but I had the money for? What do you think? Oh, here comes the evaluation. Get out of the way, cute little puppy. Patch Miller. Right, let's see if we can get in here for a little close-up see how Quincy feels about his new single bed. I wonder if he just comes in here when he's got, he has an argument with his whiff. Congratulations, oh, congratulations on a new bedroom set remodel. Would you like to take a picture for your portfolio? The reason I went, oh, is because overall I think you did a good job. I appreciate how much money you've saved me. Also, I absolutely love those handcrafted objects you use. I wouldn't mind working with you in the future. Thanks. Frankie earned 300 simoleons, including a 100 simoleon bonus. And I don't think it was a great job. It was just a good job, but we're going to take a photo now anyway. So let's get a picture of this new bedroom set. If I can just get over here. Um, and let's go for that. That looks good. Perfecto. Perfecto. I captured furniture. Awesome. Right. So let's just double check. No, that hasn't gone to the um, renovation. <laughs> Have we been kicked out of the house? No, we haven't. 
Oh, goodness. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this part of Right Designs right here. I know we only got to one renovation, but hey, we were able to drum up some business at the Summer Vis Festival. And I'm going to go ahead and blame Quincy Miller because we had to chase him all around town to get him back to his house so that he could evaluate the renovation that we did on his home. And that pretty much took all a darn day. So, yeah we're gonna blame Quincy Miller and although the renovation was good it wasn't great we are still stuck on zero out of 100 so we've got a long way to go so I'm gonna go away and do some research about how we can get some great renovations to boost these scores up and I'm hoping for the next part that we can get at least two renovations done but I'm gonna go ahead and take the weekend because it is Friday and Frankie does have the weekends off I'm gonna take the weekend to work on Frankie's skill get her painting skill up and then she also does have some scrap in her inventory and because we've got a little bit of moolah I'm gonna go ahead and buy a scrap bench so that she can go ahead and work on those place the items that she makes in her clients homes and hopefully that will help boost her scores now if these are still here on Monday we may be able to take a look at those so let me know what you think about these we've got a man cave which is for old Mr. Riffin where's Mr. Riffin here there's Mr. Riffin, Mr. Calvin Riffin, who found us very attractive, and he was all for us assessing his design needs, but when we showed him our portfolio, he was like, nah, I'm all right. So I don't know how I feel about this man cave. And then we've got an exterior makeover over here. We've also got the study for honey... Where did Honey go? For Honey Darnell, who is a celebrity. So we got pretty far with Honey Darnell for her being a celebrity. And then we also have a single ladies den. So like I said, not sure if these will still be here on Monday, but if they are, I would love to know what you guys would like to see Frankie take on next. But if you enjoyed this part of Right Designs, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know your guys' thoughts. And if you guys aren't already subscribed and you like what you see, why don't you go ahead and hit that button? Don't be a plum stranger now, guys. Bye!